Modern cars are operated via an internal network of more than 50 electronic control units. Recent incidents have shown such ECUs to be vulnerable to various kinds of remote attacks, which threatens the safety of passengers and other road users alike. While recent standardization and research efforts address security, few security mechanisms are implemented in current cars. In this video, we demonstrate Vulcan, a lightweight and efficient framework for implementing industry standard compliance and secure vehicular communication based on embedded trusted computing. We use the open source Sankus hardware level security architecture to establish trust in a simplified traction control system. Our demo system consists of a number of ECUs, some of which represent sensors or actuators at the wheels. Other ECUs perform centralized processing tasks. All ECUs are interconnected via a controller area network, the blue cable in our demo setup. CAN is the most prevalent network in vehicles and enables ECUs to jointly operate the car's overall behavior and safety critical functionality. To demonstrate real-world applicability, we connected two off-the-shelf instrument clusters. An important feature of Vulkan is software extensibility by multiple distrusting remote software providers. We therefore organized our demo application as a distributed set of trusted software components, which are compiled on a PC and subsequently deployed over an untrusted network to the ECUs. Untrusted support software on the participating ECUs loads and schedules the trusted components, whereas their authenticity can be established at runtime through a process known as remote attestation. The black keypad abstracts genuine driver interaction via steering wheel and brake pedals. Inputs from this keypad are processed on a central ECU, which reacts by sending control messages over the CAN bus. CAN is a broadcast medium. Anyone connected to the bus can see or even modify these messages. We show this by recording all traffic on the PC. ECUs at the wheels or within the instrument clusters react upon receiving control messages. Many attacks against automotive control networks rely on an attacker with access to the CAN bus to inject arbitrary messages. In our demo, we even go one step further and assume a powerful attacker that also executes software on the crucial central ECU. These attacker interactions are triggered by the red keypad. Under attack, the left and the right sides of the setup behave differently. The right side shows how a car without our security solution would react, as the attacker sends messages to activate the direction indicators and to display a high engine speed, the right instrument cluster and ECUs accept and display the spoofed values. Our vulcanized components on the left side accept authenticated messages only and indeed reject the attacker's messages. We demonstrate how unmodified legacy devices without Sankus can be transparently shielded. For this, we connect a second instrument cluster to a Vulcan gateway, which forwards authenticated messages from the untrusted blue CAN bus over the yellow private CAN bus. The gateway ensures that attacker messages are rejected. The driver can even be notified of an ongoing attack by triggering a warning indicator in the dashboard. Our demo illustrates that vulcanized software components never react to injected messages for which authenticity and freshness cannot be verified. Even a powerful attacker with code execution abilities on ECUs will not be able to extract the required cryptographic keys to construct such authenticated messages due to the strong isolation guarantees provided by the underlying Sankus architecture. Yet such an attacker may harm availability by monopolizing an ECU or by performing denial-of-service attacks against the network, which are domains of active ongoing research at Distrinet. Since we value both research transparency and reproducibility, we open sourced all of our hardware designs, plus the complete software stack and a simulator. For more info and related research efforts, visit the Vulcan and Sankus websites or GitHub pages linked below.